Come on. partner. Woo! I was almost a meal there. I know, girl. Just give me a second. for space in your satchel, just bring me the right materials and I'll work something up for you. You know, Arthur, I can always make you a new satchel if you're tight on space. Mr. Morgan, bring me some materials and I'll be glad to make something nice for you. How are you on space in that bag of yours, Mr. Morgan? Just let me know if you need me to make you a new one. Just remember, my items are one of a kind, Mr. Morgan. I'm very into my crafting at the moment, Mr. Morgan. I'm very happy to make you something if you bring me the right materials. Arthur, don't forget, I'm more than happy to craft you something if you bring me the right materials. How are you on space in that bag of yours, Mr. Morgan? Just let me know if you need me to make you a new one. You know, Arthur, I can always make you a new satchel if you're tight on space. Without a doubt, the Legend of the East Satchel is the most important single item of the game. To have an almost infinite amount of storage capacity is very convenient. To get this satchel, you would need to obtain 21 perfect pelts of 14 different kinds of animals. Deliver them to Pearson. Purchase leather working tools for Pearson. Upgrade medicine wagon twice. Upgrade provisions wagon twice. Donate three items to the tithing box. Donate $50 to the tithing box. And craft three recipes at the camp's scout fire. With that done, Pearson can craft all the satchels, including the Legend of the East satchels. But hey, hold on a second. What's going on? What's the rush? Hello and welcome. It's me again with another video guide. I just mentioned the basic of how you can craft the Legend of the East satchel. But let us give some proper and well-deserved respect to this wonderful item and put all of this into some perspective. If you aim to achieve 100% game completion, there is no better item to have than the Legend of the East Satchel. To me, 
Nowhere in the game this fact comes to life more clearly than during the Herbalist Challenge 7, when we'd need to craft 5 special miracle tonics. Having this satchel and having more capacity to store item is a great time saver in the long run and should not be underestimated. Therefore, any player should seriously consider crafting this satchel as early as the beginning of chapter 2. The fundamental that this 9 part video series is organized upon is not to rush through the process. Let us go through everything in an orderly manner and see and realize what the outcome of the steps we take is. Let us take our time and see how to unlock and craft individual satchels one by one and from scratch step by step. Let us pretend that we are a beginner and don't know anything about this game. Let us pretend that our money management is worse than mine and that we have no money at all to start with. And now, let us pretend with these handicaps we want to get the Legend of the East Satchel at the beginning of chapter 2. Where would we start? How would we proceed? These are the questions we will answer in the following videos. As this is the introductory video, our next video will be about preparation. That is how to get money as well as the necessary weapons. After the preparation is done and in the following 7 videos, we will go through the process of unlocking, hunting and crafting individual satchels, one video per satchel. The starting point of this guide is immediately after the stables are unlocked, that is after the completion of the exit pursued by a bruised ego mission. This is done just to provide us the ability to have easy access to the food supply for our horse. Also, having a brush is a handy tool to clean her up. Please note that this video series primary focus is on crafting the legend of the East Satchel and as such I will not be interacting with any NPCs unless it is necessary for our purpose. With that out of the way, let us meet in the next video.